Welcome to Jakarta. Welcome to Tana Abang. And there in front of us is Tana Abang Bukit. Tana Abang Heuvel. An English hill. Let's have a look. My grand Tana Abang Heuvel Bukit estate. This is the majestic entrance. Four houses on this estate. And I'll show you around. So this is the stylish driveway to the house that was probably most relevant for my family. Tana Abang Heuvel number 146 and this is where the family used to drink tea in the afternoons and you had a beautiful view of the uh, quiet road, the tram passing by, the birds and sometimes a Chinese funeral procession. You see it's still a very peaceful atmosphere. Now and then from here they walk back in. So roughly around here was the entrance to the front gallery. Beautiful paintings and a seating and oh yeah etc you could walk into the house and and back on the driveway towards the estate entrance this is where my grandmother and her siblings at the end of the day in pajamas walked across the road to the house of their grandparents Peter Albert de Nijsbik and Shanev Rosalie de Nijsbik Butenbik that was here um, separate driveway to that house Tana Abang Heuvel number 140 a similar single story home now that's here and then from here they could walk onto the front gallery where the grandparents sat and probably enjoyed a cup of tea or maybe something stronger back onto the main entrance and this is the lane lined with palm trees, tennis court on the right here, that leads to the two majestic double story houses on the hill, number 142 on the right side and number 144 on the left side in the far distance of course because it was pretty sizable here. We are at the back garden of uh, number 142, owned by the Factory, but between 1928 and 1930 it was inhabited by the family Piet Lachai, his wife and his daughter Mary. And from here we have a beautiful view of, um, of the house, in the peaceful back garden. And at the side of the Lachai residence was Gang Kabon Dalan, still named this way. And then behind here was Kampung Tan Aranda. And why was Kampung Tan Aranda called this way? Well, Tan Aranda means low land. And you can actually see here why that is. It lies lower than Tan Aban. Bukit, Bukit means hill. Alright, I hope you enjoyed this tour in Tana Aban Bukit. Of course, this estate needs to be maintained in a meticulous condition, hence, we ask you kindly to donate a few thousand rupiah. I'm going to look for the nearest tram stop because we have a party in Hotel Dazen tonight. <laughs>